The case is a male, 83 years old, now he's retired after work and he has different comorbidities like hypertensive heart disease and diabetes mellitus. No previous interventions uh, he performed and uh, uh, renal tumor uh, appears with symptomatology with the gross hematuria and uh, abdominal pain. At CT scan and ultrasound, uh, we uh, observed a nodule of 4 cm. We performed a percutaneous biopsy and uh, it uh, was a clear renal cell carcinoma, G2. And so we decided to treat it with microwave of these lesions. Well, uh, as you can see in this CT, we can see very well uh, the lesion. That is a 4 cm for 3.8 and it localized at the lower lobe of right kidney. And we uh, decide to treat these uh, lesions under ultrasound and contrast ultrasound guidance. And also we uh, used the, the Combeam CT with X per guide guidance of, uh, in Anjo Suite. And we decided to put uh, two antennas inside the lesion. Uh, we use it through two 3.7 uh, centimeter uh, antennas from Evident Covidian and uh, we use it a generator of nine, uh, 915 MHz of uh, Covidian that works at 45 watts for 10 minutes. But the all procedures uh, have a duration about half an hour. We start to use microwave ablation since uh, 2008 and now we have very good results. Usually the decision making is uh, performed by a group of different uh, uh, medical doctors. This is a, a multidisciplinary team where work an uh, oncologist, anesthesiologist, pneumologist, uh, thoracic surgeon, uh, general surgeon and intervention radiologist. Usually, if there are no complications related to the procedures, the patients stay in hospital one, two days, no more. But sometimes, like in a renal tumor treatment, we perform a protocol that we can discharge the patients in the same day, so we can treat in the hospital the patients. This is our study because we would like to compare to other techniques like radiofrequency ablation or cryoablation. And uh, up to now we demonstrated that it's a safe procedure and uh, doesn't worsen the uh, renal functions. And also it is very interesting because the time of procedures is shorter compared to other uh, procedures and uh, compared to a cryoablation, we can reduce costs and we can reduce the number of the axis and the number of the needle inside the lesion. This uh, kind of uh, uh, procedures is uh, less time consuming 
compared to radiofrequency ablation and also give less pain to the patients because the patient is not enclosed in the electric field and also um, you have a better defined area of ablation when you compare it to radiofrequency ablation. Also in the kidney you can treat cystic lesions uh, because you have not heat sink effect like it occurs for radiofrequency ablation.